biggest impact of this redevelopment of the Gabba is going to be an extraordinary fan experience. So each of the respective quarters will have a different colour, um, each of the new entrances, so this one's yellow, we've also got a maroon, a green and uh, a blue. I understand there's some uh, pretty fancy outcomes in terms of the, um, the, the lighting. We can essentially make them whatever colour you want. To open it all up for people to sit and eat and when we can get back to doing that together at a, a football stadium. Comes into a barbecue grill. Oh nice, yep. And then we've got the other bar. Yeah, it's just going to be very. It's going to be very popular. <laughs> Rather than leaving the venue to go somewhere for lunch, I'd stay here during a, a test match. And what that equals is winning events like the first test uh, later this year. So we're going to see India here on the 3rd of December. It means we're going to see a full stadium eventually when we can get back to full stadiums for events like the Big Bash. Uh, and it's going to mean that uh, Lions fans come here and they're going to have the sorts of facilities that footy fans anywhere in Australia would expect is the very best. What an honour to be working on the upgrade to the Gabba, hey? As we sort of recover out of COVID-19, it's all about making sure that you've got a steady pipeline of work, finish your apprenticeship uh, and uh, find the next you know, significant project to work on. It's going to be uh, a very big improvement on what they had before and hopefully it's very schmick, looks very good. When you're finished with it, it's going to be one of the best stadiums in the world. We're very, very proud uh, to be working with Wattpack uh, to deliver this. It's great, we've been back here for over a few years doing a lot of upgrades. Great spot for a Queensland company to be. It sure is, and uh, in the future as well. It is a great time uh, to see the revival of the Gabba. We're very proud to be a part of it. <laughs>